Hello and welcome to Janky Cooking with Jesse. We are about to get started making Irish potato soup for lunch. We have some potatoes. It came in from our delivery. So we have new foods to try. Yay! We didn't have quite enough potatoes, so I had to get creative. But here we go. First, we're supposed to put 150 grams of onions quartered in here. I measured everything in advance. Onions. Yep, onions. Will you put those in? Oh, thanks. And as you can see, I had some frozen onions, just like I always, whenever I make soup, I take whatever's left over and just throw it in the freezer so they're a little wet. Okay, next we need to insert our measuring cup into our loop. And for three seconds at speed five. We're going to scrape down the sides of our mixing bowl. I'm going to scrape sides, okay? Uh, can you actually see in there? Yeah. Yeah, actually, let me do this part because... Why? Uh, well, the, it's an angle issue. Your arms are not necessarily very long yet. As you get older, your arms will grow. Okay? Now this? Not yet. Let's hold off until I actually tell you the, the next step, okay? Okay. Okay. Oh, now we add the bacon. Would you throw the bacon in? Bacon is yummy, right? It can be, but don't it's, worry. There we go. It's yummy for Drake. Yeah, Drake likes bacon. But don't worry, there won't be any chunks, Ivy. You won't even be able to see it. Okay, next we're going to add the butter. Oh, yep, yeah, I keep putting the lid back on, but it's not time. Would you throw the butter in? Okay, let's just get it it's kind of stuck there. I cubed it all up. Probably I didn't have to work that hard, but I think I can put the lid on now. Let's see. Okay, as you can see, the thermal mix has stopped. We can take a look. I'm going to scrape down our sides. Whoa, sorry. Steamy, steamy, steamy. That tastes like yum, right? Yep, it tastes, well, not yet. It doesn't taste like yum yet. I hope it wanted us to do that. It's a good thing we already did it. So we're going to add in the potatoes. Peeled and cut into pieces. I also potatoes. threw a little bit of yellow squash in there because I ran out of potatoes. Okay, then we're going to throw in our vegetable stock, and after our vegetable stock, we're going to throw in some milk. I didn't have vegetable stock, so I'm throwing in chicken stock because it's what I have. And I don't know how it's going to turn out because I've never made this before. So we shall see. So that's vegetable stock, or chicken stock and milk. Now we're going to cook it for 25 minutes and it will be at 90 degrees at speed one half. So this is just barely going to be moving, but this is stirring that you don't have to do for 25 minutes. We will see you when this is all finished. The thermal mix has finished and we are going to move on to the next step. Once yes. that, not yet, not yet, not that one yet. We're going to add sea salt, black yes. pepper, and nutmeg. Yep, pour that in. Thank you, ma'am. And then we're supposed to add 110 grams of single cream. We don't have single cream. We're going to use whole milk. But Ivy, uh, we got to go slowly because I haven't actually measured that. Okay, well, that works. Uh, let's just hope that was about 110 grams. I'm going to put our lid back on. Before we do that, though, I'm just going to push this down. Just make sure everything is in the liquid, huh? Is it going to be not loud? No, mm, I think it's going to be quite loud. You're going to want to cover your ears. Good job. Okay, one minute at speed nine. Yeah, this is going to be loud. Here we go. No, no, I've got to work here. Oh, work here. We graduate to speed nine. Cover your ears, kiddo. Our minute has passed. We're gonna see what it looks like in here. I'm assuming a little different than it looked a moment ago. Whoa, it's like a whole new soup. What do you think, Ivy? Yes, uh -oh. I wouldn't mind. You wouldn't mind this? No. We look how creamy a mix that is. Do it like that. Okay, you can do one. Don't pull it out though, it's hot. Here you go. Okay. Okay, and don't touch the thermal mix, it's hot too. This is the soup we're gonna have for lunch today. I hope you're all having a delicious lunch as well. I will post final pictures of the soup in just a minute.
Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this, please feel free to like, subscribe if you haven't. If you're interested in a Thermomix, just let me know. I'm around. Take care. Bye-bye.